He was a regular teenager from Indianapolis who loved to play the guitar. But now Father Michael Perry lives in Rome and is the Minister General of the Franciscan Order. And it all started when he decided to take a month off of work. I was working building houses as a way of making money. And my boss, who the owner of the company who was Catholic, I said, I want to go and give one month for the, to build houses for the poor. And he said, OK, I'll pay your salary. So he paid me salary. I went. I met the Franciscans. I saw what they were doing. I fell in love with what they were doing working with the poor. In fact, at one point, he was considering studying law. But in the end, he chose religious life. In May 2013, he was elected as Minister General of the Franciscans, where he leads the very order that St. Francis of Assisi began more than 800 years ago. It's not really a promotion, he says, but rather, it's just the opposite. It's not an increase, it's a decrease. It's not a rise, I hope that it's a descent. It's not assuming power or authority, it's descending to the last place. He says leading with efficiency is all about inner freedom. And he says Pope Francis lives out this example in his life and style. I've been with him three times, and each time I find this man, he doesn't need to be Pope. He doesn't want the authority. He is a man who is absolutely free. And because he's free, he's able to revolutionize our thinking and make us all question who we are and where we're going not just as Catholics, but as Christians, as Muslims, as human beings. And so, hundreds of years after the order was founded, it now has more than 13,500 religious members serving throughout the world. And even more, the spirituality of St. Francis of Assisi has inspired dozens of movements, both lay and religious.